Hello, my name is Daniel O'Keefe, and I am the president and principal of Cardinal Spelman High School. And it's my privilege to welcome you to our plans for the 2020-21 school year. Schools are going to look a little bit different this year, but we are going to still give the Spelman experience. You can be assured that the health and safety of your children is our priority. And while keeping them safe and healthy, we will also offer the excellent academic program that you trust us to give. We are practicing social distance protocols. Every student will be six feet away from another student and every student will be required to wear a mask. When students enter in the morning, students will be checked for their temperature. Before students come to school, we request that every family do a pre-screening for COVID-19 conditions. There's a checklist of different symptoms of which you should be aware. And if your child has any of those symptoms, we ask you to keep him home so that the rest of the community remains healthy and safe. We have hand washing stations at different points around the building. We have hand sanitizer stations at different points around the building. Hallways and stairways will be one way only, and everyone wears a face mask. And because the Spelman experience is so important, and we want to make sure that every student receives the Spelman experience, you can be sure that your child will receive superior academics, extracurriculars when and where allowed, even if remote, and an excellent program of spiritual guidance. Hello. My name is Kyle O'Donnell. I'm the Assistant Principal of Academics here at Cardinal Spelman High School. I want to talk a little bit about our academic program for this year, as it's going to be a little bit different than what we've seen in the past. I guarantee you, though, the standards and the tradition of Cardinal Spelman academics will be intact no matter which way we go through instruction. As you've seen over the summer, there have been two ways that you could choose for instruction for your child, one being remote, and one being through our hybrid or blended learning model. For those who are remote, they will be going from class to class via Google Meet in their Google Classroom for each of their teachers. For those who are in hybrid, they'll be broken up into four groups, four cohorts, A, B, C, and D. The cohorts will meet on the following days. Cohort A will meet on days one and day five, Cohorts B on days two and day six, cohort C on days three and day seven, and cohort D on days four and days eight. These four groups will be coming in at least once and possibly twice a week for their in-person learning experience. With this, in classes of between five and ten students, they'll be joining their other classmates who are learning from home as well. So the classroom environment will look very different, but there'll still be the collaboration that you've grown to love through Cardinal Spelman Academics. As you can see with the new classroom setup, desks are situated in such a way that students maintain proper social distancing. All students will be wearing a mask, the teacher will be in front of the classroom. And we are blessed with the technology at Spelman that teachers with their Chromebook or with a swivel camera in their class will be able to instruct the students present in the building while at the same time, giving a lesson in a live stream to the students at home. So while one cohort is here and the other three cohorts at home, all four cohorts are receiving education synchronously, which means at the same time, the same class with the same teacher. And there will be other changes to expect. Uh, scheduling will be slightly different. We've eliminated homeroom periods so that attendance and announcements will take place during first period. We'll have strict times where students can enter and exit the building. Students are expected to come to school by 8.15 in the morning with homeroom starting at 8.30. Dismissal at the end of the day will be after the student's last period class ends. And for extracurricular activities, I strongly recommend you urge your children and students, if you're listening, I urge you to participate in any online activities after school, clubs, e-gaming, CS1. We have countless opportunities for you to interact on a social level with your classmates and your schoolmates in a virtual world. Thank you for sending your children to Spelman, for trusting us to educate your children during a pandemic, and to work with you to keep your children healthy and safe. God bless you all.